riding today is fantastic. It's not too hot, the sun's in your face, you've got the wind blowing, the smells, cut grass, and rolling by a barbecue shop and smelling that, or cookies, uh, it's crazy what you smell. You know, I started really young, probably, gosh, I don't know, four years old or so, uh, but I used to ride to work. That was my transportation until I got a car for years and years. The thing about being in a car is it, you're, you disconnect yourself. Uh, you can't disconnect yourself on a bicycle in traffic. You can't. And you are no longer the top dog. And that's really important. I actually think that that feeling is important to help you make you a better driver because you're more aware of what's around you in the world. So I founded Maverick Charities to give back, to expand opportunity for other folks. We partner with organizations who help incarcerated folks who are coming out of incarceration get back on their feet. And some of them can't have licenses. We're about to donate 50 bikes to Loudoun County Public Schools. We plan on doing it frequently throughout the year, uh, at least twice a year. Bicycling in the United States uh, has been increasing over the last decade or two in, in certain cities and places like Minneapolis, San Francisco, Portland, Washington, D.C. Bicycling has gotten an, an additional boost by a very unfortunate event, which is the, the COVID crisis. And many people found themselves uh, at home um, and in the need for physical activity and they were flocking to bikes, uh, often for recreational purposes. We have uh, uh, people who still go to work or have to make a trip but are not comfortable making it on public transport anymore. The more people ride their bikes, the more likely drivers know cyclists who ride their bikes, the more likely drivers are cyclists themselves. And we are developing more of a, of a traffic culture that's watching out for the other because the cyclist is not the unknown or the other. But it may be your friend or your work colleague and you can sort of relate to the people who are, who are on bikes. So I think it's changing the, the traffic culture. About 40% of all trips that are taken a day are shorter than two miles. It is a very bikeable distances. So there's a great potential, especially in cities. The more the community rides, the more the community will enjoy riding together. And in the end, it brings us closer together. That's what bicycles do. They enable the world and they bring us closer together.